Despite Modern Warfare 2's strong launch, Warzone 2 hasn't been well enough received to guarantee the income Activision wants over the next year and so plans to move COD onto a two-year cycle has been scrapped. What can we say? It's the age-old culprit, Activision's greed. They love that young money. This comes from Insider Gaming. Previous rumors have suggested that the game will be premium DLC for Modern Warfare 2 and although that appears to have been true at one point, Insider Gaming understands that the project changed direction to become a full premium standalone release planned for 2023. They had originally planned to release a kind of map pack with a bit of campaign content in November but more as an expansion to Modern Warfare 2. They must have realized that the DLC content they were developing had just enough content for them to be able to wrap it up in a shiny new bow and call it a full game. Well, this is going to be a terrible Call of Duty. All we know so far is that it's going to be developed by Sledgehammer and it leads from Modern Warfare 2. Heck, it might even be sold as Modern Warfare 3, milking the last of the OG trilogy's reputation for shame. Where would you like the next Call of Duty to be set? And are you pleased about getting a new COD this year? 